Welcome back, Jim Rats. Delta here from DeltaIsGaming.com. Uh, I've been away, get my personal training certificate, got that done. So I'm here with an arm workout called Armageddon. What I'm going to do here real quick is get a 10-minute warm-up on my treadmill. We're in the basement, no fancy equipment, just we're just going to get nasty in the dungeon at Delta's dungeon tonight. So my training split, for those of you who want to know, I do chest on Sundays, legs, uh, Monday, back, I take a day off, I do shoulders, then I do arms, then a day off. And that's what I do, and I just basically walk for about an hour or so. So today I'm going to show you what I do for arms. The main thing that I've got uh, trying to get my arms fuller and bigger is really just to get the blood in them. Don't focus so much on how much weight you're doing or how much weight someone else is doing. Focus on the actual contraction of the muscle. And what I like to do is do triceps and biceps together. So I superset them together. Because it doesn't take a whole lot of oxygen to do a curl. So what it does is it forces the blood to go from one spot to another. It really keeps your heart rate up. The workout goes a lot faster and I feel like I got a bigger pump. My muscles feel fuller. So that's what we're going to do today. Nasty, dirty dungeon. Just ugh, Let's get it. All right, warmed up, blood's pumping in these, these arms. So we're gonna superset, like I said, we're gonna do uh, a bench press, narrow grip. So that's gonna focus on the triceps, not so much the chest or the shoulders. Trick is tuck your elbows in, full extension up, make sure it feel, you can feel the tricep, not the chest. Then we're gonna run over here and we're gonna do some uh, strict curls. Let's get after it. All right, last set of this. Delta, motivation time. Woo. 15 weeks out. Made a lot of progress in my life, in my physique, obviously, but more importantly, it's the life. And it starts with thoughts. Everything you see a screwdriver, a car, a plane, a bird started with a thought. So think about what you want and then actions. Look, there's a million diets, there's a million exercise programs, there's a million personal trainers. I'm not saying one is the better than the other. But if you think about what you want, you believe in yourself, and you work hard for it every day, seven days a week, you can get it. It might take a year, it might take you two, it might take you five, it might take you a decade. But don't quit. Everyone in society wants it yesterday. Don't quit. It's easier to win now than it ever has been because people want to quit. All right. Second exercise up, we're gonna do dips. Dippity dippity doos. Now, I like to do dips. If I wanna do it from chest, I put my arms out wider, I can actually see the chest squeeze. If I'm trying to do them for triceps, that, look at that horseshoe. That, I put my arms in more, and I focus on the actual contraction at the end of the rep. Weightlifting, getting muscles, and all this stuff, it's not that complicated. Don't worry about how much you lift at first. Focus on the form, squeezing, contracting the muscle, getting the blood in there, doing it right. The weight will come uh, later. Usually I have plates that sit on my lap. No one's here to spot me, so I'm just gonna do a million reps. Woo! Then we're gonna go do some curls. Thing with curls. Now you'll see me put, curl into them like this. Why I do that is a tip from Charles Glass watching Flex Wheeler work out. Hey, you're the best, got some of the best arms in the world, so. That's why I learned how to do that, and it really feels like you get more of a contraction than just sitting here being strict. So to each their own. There's more than one way to skin a cat. There's a lot more ways to get big, but it starts with hard work. You start there, you'll get it. Just take time. Let's go. Last exercise of the day. So we're gonna do behind the head, tricep extensions. Something I struggle at because I got that ulnar nerve damage from the time in the service, but hey, everyone got something. Then we're gonna do straight bar curls. 
Now Arnold used to do these and called cheaters. So he'd over overload it where he couldn't do anymore and he kind of swing a little bit. So when he gets real heavy, we're gonna cheat a little bit, but for the most part we're trying to stick strict. Contract them biceps. Let's go! We're gonna do forearms now. I got these German genetics, right? So my forearms get pretty big pretty easily. So I don't want to do too much. What I like doing is what I call motorcycles is taking a flat bar and doing this, just raising it or reverse curls, whatever you want to call it. And then taking another bar, same bar, and rolling it up like this. So that feels it gives me right here and right here. Get all them veins to come out, you know what I mean? Veins are cool! All right, we're all done with arms. Arms, triceps, biceps, forearms. Feeling really good. Year, 15 weeks out. Starting to get leaner, the diet's starting to get harder. Uh, holidays rolling around, it's tough. It's hard to make tough decisions when everyone else is eating bad, drinking, you know, doing all this sort of stuff, but you gotta have a goal and it begins with thoughts and beliefs in yourself, whatever it is, whether it's gaming, whether it's this. Look, succeeding in life in anything. It's just making those hard choices day in and day out. If you want to get better at video games, do the same thing. You want to better your job at lifting weights. I wanted to get out of the damn basement and be a good example to my son, y'all, and myself. And hold myself accountable for just sitting around drinking Mountain Dew and not doing anything for society. So I got my personal training certificate, looking at probably trying to get a part-time job doing that. Or full time, we'll see how it goes. But man, this is this is my spark. This is what drives me. This is my passion. This is, and it ain't comfortable all the time. But that's where the growth happens. If you're comfortable in the gym, you're comfortable at your job, you're comfortable doing this and that, you're not going to grow. Challenge yourself today. I challenge myself every day. Can I get a little more discipline in my diet? Can I be a better father? Can I be a better husband? I fail sometimes, to be, to be frank with you, but. I'm going to keep trying. I'm going to keep trying to be a better me so I can be a better to you guys. So thanks so much for watching. Let me know what videos you want to see next. We got to do, do a chest one soon, right? Look at that chest. Man, it's been a great year. A lot more to come. Thanks for watching.